I found this great piece on grief that just hit the nail on the head. This was on Facebook um, from an account by Becky Hemsley called Talking to the Wild. It says, there is no solution to grief. It is not a problem that can be solved or a task to be completed. It is an unfinished jigsaw, a puzzle with a piece perpetually lost. You can tell what the picture is, but there are details missing, like the sky missing a cloud or the ocean missing a wave. It's still the sky, it's still the ocean, but it is quietly incomplete. This is still life, but it is a piece, it is missing a piece, a piece you will always long for. There is no solution to your puzzle because that piece was shaped to your jigsaw, to your life, to you, and you will never replace it. It is irreplaceable because it was shaped uniquely by love. So it is okay that you will never feel full again. It's okay that you'll never feel the true satisfaction of completing the puzzle. This is still love. It is still life. It is just quietly incomplete. I've talked to a lot of widows, uh, widows I've met in person, widows I've talked to on here, people I've followed, whether it's been a few months or years, whether these, these widows even remarried, that is the truth. That person that you lost isn't replaceable. Even for widows who marry, that wasn't a replacement husband. They found love again, but it didn't take, it didn't like close up the wound from the loss of that husband. Just like a, a person who uses a, loses a child, if they later on have another child, it's it's not a replacement. It doesn't it doesn't say I'm I'm good. I'm you know that that's gone. You always love that person. That person is always missing from your life, and I'm I've heard this same sentiment over and over again. And I think in, in our culture, we, we have so not talked about grief. We've so not supported each other so that grief people just kind of hide and shut up after a while. And I think the more we can talk, the better it's going to be.